Do you want to display your most commented posts in WordPress? If you highlight your commented posts and it helps your readers and visitors know what your best content is. It also increases page views. It also boosts website engagement. Plus it also shows a little bit of social proof to your readers on your most popular content. So in this video, I'll walk you through step by step on how to display most commented posts in WordPress. And we'll cover two different methods so you can pick the one that works best for you. So let's dive in. There are several different WordPress popular post plugins out there that you can use to display your popular articles. But the simplest and easiest to use is by installing and using Monster Insights. With Monster Insights, you can easily connect your website with Google Analytics. It's the best analytics solution for WordPress and it's used by over 3 million websites. And so with this plugin, you can easily display your most popular content by comments. There is a free version of Monster Insights that you can use to see how your website is doing with Google Analytics. But to show you the most popular posts by comments, you'll want to use the pro version or higher. So you can head over to monsterinsights.com. Make sure you use promo code WPBVIP. You'll get the best discount on Monster Insights and then you can set it up. You can watch this video as I walk you through how to install and set up Google Analytics with your WordPress website. And that's by installing Monster Insights. And once you get everything set up from your dashboard, you can go down to Monster Insights and go to Popular Posts. With the popular post widget, then we can showcase our popular post. The first thing you want to do is set up the theme that you want. And this gives you an idea of what this will look like. And then you can briefly see the theme preview as you're clicking on them. You also have a few other items of how you want it to look wide or narrow. And then scrolling down, you can customize it even further. For me, you can choose how many to display, what all you want to display based by comments, the date, author and sort by this is how it chooses how your widget will determine your most popular posts and this will be by comments it will randomly rotate the comments on posts in the past 30 days scrolling down even further there are a few embed options and these are the ways that it will display the first one is it can just be automatically placed so if you read here it says automatically enabling automatic placement it includes the most popular posts after the last paragraph of any and all posts that match your behavior settings so the most commented posts, the style will customize the design panel above. With the automatic play placement, it'll automatically add this after any and all of the posts that match your criteria that you've just added. If you want to do it like that, you can simply scroll up, click save changes and you're done and it will automatically show on all of your posts. Now, if you want a little bit more control over it, you also have these other items where you can display using the Gutenberg blocks, short code or in a sidebar area. And let me show you what that will look like. So if you don't want automatic placement, then you can turn that off and then we'll display it manually. So you can go to all posts, pick the post that you want to add the most popular post to. For instance, I'll just choose this one. I'll scroll down to the bottom, go to a new line and we can click on the add block area and we want to search for popular posts. This is the one we want. And this item will come up so where we can choose the theme that we want. And now that's good to go. When we click update, it'll bring all of those in. You can also showcase your popular posts in your sidebar area. To do that, let's head back to our dashboard. From here, let's go to appearance, widgets, and we'll want to add that popular post widget to our sidebar area. So we can click on the widgets, add block, look for the popular post, monster insights. I'm going to left click and drag this up here. And again, you can choose how to display it here. Once you update everything, and let's head back over and refresh our dashboard. And now we have popular posts here as well. Now method two, you can display the most commented posts without a plugin. That's by adding code. So you'll want to be comfortable with doing this. You'll also want to back up your website in case anything happens. You can check out a link in the description below for the article, the written article to this that also showcases the actual code that you can add to your website. And if you want to get the most out of Monster Insights, make sure you watch this video next as I walk you through step by step on how to install and activate Monster Insights with Google Analytics on your website. And I'll see you over there.